This installation guide is compatible with both sealed and non-sealed edge Easy Curve mops. To assemble the Easy Curve mop, first fold both sides of the polyester flaps along the perforated lines of the mop head. Align the mop head with the frame and push all the tabs into the slots of the frame. Push the quick connect handle into the mop frame. Adjust the pivot nut so that the mop head pivots as needed. The mop head can easily be removed by unlatching all the tabs from the frame. We will demonstrate mopping walls and floors using the Easy Curve mop with a two bucket system fitted with a contact curved stainless steel sieve. The correct sequence is to mop the ceiling, then the walls, followed by the floor. To clean or disinfect walls with the Easy Curve mop, First adjust the handle to the desired length for the surface being cleaned. Wet the mop head with cleaning solution. Ring off excess solution. Note that ringing is made easier by holding the mop handle at an angle from vertical and pressing on the handle directly over the sieve. To mop the wall using horizontal strokes, begin cleaning at the top of the wall and progress downward to the floor. Clean the entire wall by going from left to right in overlapping strokes progressing from ceiling to floor. Ring completely into the waste bucket. Wet the mop head with the cleaning solution and repeat this cycle. To mop the wall using vertical strokes, clean from the top of the wall using overlapping vertical strokes. In either method, after each stroke, ring and apply clean solution and continue with overlapping strokes. Repeat the sequence to clean the entire wall. To clean or disinfect floors with the Easy Curve mop, with the mop and bucket ready, wet the mop head with the cleaning solution. Ring off any excess solution. Start from the corner opposite the room's exit. There are two common mopping methods used with this style of mop, the S-curve and place and pull. Mop in an S-shaped pattern covering about one square meter of floor area at a time. Ring completely into the waste bucket. Wet the mop head with the cleaning solution and repeat the cycle. Mop using the place and pull method. The ringing and rinsing cycle is the same as the S-curve method of mopping. Start from the corner opposite the room's exit, covering about one square meter at a time using overlapping strokes. Ring completely into the waste bucket. Wet the mop head with the cleaning solution and repeat the cycle. Regardless of the method used, continue mopping out of the room until the entire floor surface is cleaned.